Good morning, Bitcoins! Today is still Monday, October 6, 2014, and I'm still in Lima, Peru, where I learned that they once elected a rhinoceros to city council. A nice choice. I'm sure you all recall the time when Nero made his horse a senator. Then Rome burned. Oops. Must have been Mrs. O'Leary's cow. Mad Bitcoins likes it. Hey, Mikey, he likes it. This is Mad Bitcoins Special Report. Bitcoin prices continue to recover with Winkdex reporting a last of 329, a high of 340, and a low of 302. Here are today's Mad Bits again. Bear Whale Meme on the loose. The $30,000 Bitcoin at 300 seller is no longer a faceless leviathan destroying our very hopes and dreams. He's now a cute meme. He is the bear whale, and oh, what a wonderful meme it is. 3D printed bear whale released into the wild. This is a serious meme here, people. Bear whale t-shirts, throw pillows, tote bags, and framed art prints are available at society6.com. The bear whale is the new liger, or tygon. David Seaman quits Twitter, Bitcoin, and all ideas. Recent guest on the Bitcoin group, David Seaman, is apparently suffering from a major case of post-bear whale depression syndrome, PBWDS. In a stunning podcast, Seaman rails against Bitcoin, Twitter, and all ideas, saying repeatedly that Obama broke his heart. Whaley realizes that buildings don't self-destruct on their own. We've also got a great new Phineep graphic from our main man, Phineep. Also, Phineep.com. Plug City. Subscribe now or else. Mad Magazine Bitcoin. What? Me? Bitcoin? And check out the features inside. Cool Hash Luck. Risky Bitcoin. 21 Pump and Dump. And Coin Spotting. Only 9 millibits. Cheap. Also, judging from these Google image search pictures, I have to say, the bear usually eats the whale. Unless the whale has freaking laser beams. And now, the serious news. Overstock.com assembles coders to create a Bitcoin-like stock market. Patrick Byrne is truly an iconoclast in the very finest sense of the word. Recently announced at the Bitcoin Las Vegas convention, Byrne is partnering with mega law firm Perkins Coey to create a cryptocurrency stock market with Overstock Coin to be the very first stock. This is serious business. Or we could just call it Counterparty 2, Electric Boogaloo, The Revenge. Bitcoin Foundation releases a scalability roadmap. Gavin Andreessen, chief scientist for the Bitcoin Foundation, has sketched out a behind-the-scenes roadmap for the technical details necessary to scale Bitcoin up to face the challenges of the future. The document covers everything from the download size of the Bitcoin QT client, a new concept called pruning, which would only include the recent version of the blockchain, i.e. the end of the tail, how to increase transaction volume by reforming the one megabyte block limit, which used to be 32 megabytes. Just because Satoshi said it that way doesn't mean we have to stick to it. He's also working on an idea for a bigger block. These ideas and the discussion and implementation of them is why Bitcoin will win. Bitcoin is not static. It's software. Bitcoin, much like TCP IP before it, will change, break, be fixed, survive, and endure. It's not over. Not by a long shot. Apparatus for generating cryptocurrency seized by Russian government on Chinese border. At the customs post, Zabayaskik, four unidentified rectangular-shaped metal objects with fans on the side and chips inside attached by silver wires were discovered in the baggage of a Russian citizen who arrived from China. The undeclared items were seized because they were undeclared. And finally, the largest European payment processor is going into Bitcoin. They are the Klarna Group. According to their info page, Klarna Group has more than 1,100 employees and is active on 16 markets. They serve 25 million customers and work with 45,000 merchants. Their goal is to become the world's favorite way to buy. And now you can buy 
with Bitcoin. Very exciting news, but until next time, this has been Mad Bitcoins. Mad Bitcoins. Mad Bitcoins. My head keeps spinning. I go to sleep and keep grinning. If this is just the beginning, my life is going to be beautiful. <laughs>